Okay, my name's Ian Norris. I'm a community fund fundraiser. Uh, that means I do fundraising within the community and I cover Sudbury, Haverhill, um, all the villages in between like Lavenham and Clare, Long Melford and parts of Bury St Edmunds. Uh, we've, this year we've had open gardens in several villages. We've also had a number of little garden fates and things like that. I've been to darts tournaments. Uh, several schools have organised um, sponsored silences. Schools love sponsored silences. Well, teachers do. And we've just done general things to anything really, which people, imagination is the thing that you need most for a bit of fundraising. Well, the biggest tip of all, of course, is like everything else, keep it simple. Don't overstretch yourself. Be practical. Um, we have a, a scheme called uh, Dinner For You where you can just organise a meal for friends and get them all to pay. And that's a good thing. Or you could just have a collecting box in your own home, a little cardboard box, and put all your loose change in it. That's a valuable income to the hospice. But if you're in a church, you could see if the collection one week could come to the hospice. Or if you're in a school, you could have a non-uniform day, and everyone pays a pound, and that money goes to the hospice. So it's very simple things. You don't need to overcomplicate. You just need to have the desire to help St Nicholas Hospice care. If I could describe St Nicholas Hospice in one word, the word would be caring.